Hey guys, my name is Luigi from Luigi Reaction, and today I got a special, special video I'm gonna do for y'all today. If you guys don't know, now I make two tier list videos, and for some reason, you guys actually like it, especially the My Hero Academia one. So thank you guys so much for the love and support. The first um, tier list video was all the Persona 5 Royal Confidants, and the second video was, of course, all of the characters, some of the characters of My Hero Academia. And most of y'all love that. I was like, you know what? I'm going to make another tier list video. And what kind of tier list video I'm going to do for y'all? Well, if you see this picture I'm showing for y'all, today, I'm going to do all of the female characters, aka best girl tier list from Persona 5 Royal. And whoo! Boy, I'm gonna get so much hate, <laughs> but no, I am going to do all of the female girls, aka best girl tier list in Persona 5 Royal. I've been wanting to do this for a while, and I got everything sorted out, I got everything where I need them to be. So, you already know how this goes. I'm gonna talk about the girls, I'm gonna talk about the character, the confidants, everything, the story, everything about them, and I'm gonna put in a D, C, B, or A, or the God tier, S tier. And I think you already know who, who is the best girl. I give you a hint. A cute laugh. So anyway, guys, so let's get started with this tier list of Ouija's tier list on all of the Persona 5 Royal and or best girl tier list. Let's get started. Oh, and one more thing. Thank you guys so, so, so much for 40,000 views on the, on my main channel. Thank you guys so much for the love and support. I, when I saw it, I was immediately emotional. And nothing I can make me happier than make videos for you guys. I love making videos for you guys. I know I haven't been posting a lot since the whole thing started. But I promise I will still make videos for y'all. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much for your love and support. And thank you guys for 40,000 views. Let's do, now, the goal is to get to 50,000 views. That's our goal. And our goal is to hit 200 subscribers. That's our main goal. Hit 50 thousand views and hit 200 subscribers that's our goal guys anyway guys back to the video okay back to the tier list all right you guys so i got the tier list ready i'm getting super super not um <laughs> what, what i'm saying super super nervous and super super excited about making this video because i'm so i'm afraid that most of y'all are gonna hate me when i put all your best girl in the tier list because i'm so so scared what you guys gonna say to me but anyway guys you already you know how this thing goes i'm gonna talk about the girls talk about why i love them the appearance the design the the um clothes they wear even like the act, voice actor apparently and um what else and the confidants, of course, I'm going to talk about the confidants again for the best girl tier list. And I'm going to tell you guys why I love them so much or why I think they are okay or why I don't like them as the best girl. Anyway, guys, let's get the romance music started. And of course, you're not going to see me, um, you're not going to see me making, um, pointing things because it's hard to, you, you know, with my little hands or anything. Yeah, so you're not going to see me. Um, putting things right there is gonna see me off camera doing it. So anyway, guys, let's get started with this tier list, baby. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. If you guys want to know what this um, music is, I will leave in the description below of the music you want, guys want to listen to. It's called Persona 5. Of course, it's from the soundtrack, it's called Sweet, and I thought this song is so, so, so sweet and so romantic. Anyway, guys, let's get started on this tier list, baby. We're going to start off with the first girl we ever met. Actually, actually the first teenager, the first fancy thief girl we ever met is On, aka Lady On, aka Panther, baby. So, what can I explain to her? Her appearance is beautiful. Her school appearance is also beautiful. And I think my favorite um clothes that she wears is her winter outfit, aka she wears like sports or sports jacket on and which is so cool i love her fashion and if you guys don't know that whole japanese voice actor in my opinion one of my favorite favorite japanese voice actor in persona 5 world it is so good i love it that's why i love her because the japanese voice actor and her english voice i did an amazing job with her she is so cute and what she likes to eat, she likes to eat sweets. Like, oh, that's pretty cute. Her confidence is based on her modeling, trying to get, trying to get to know her better, trying to help over Shiho. And I think the saddest part of the confidant is when Shiho leaving. And there's an option between you have me or you have us. So, so in the Japanese version, I feel so bad for her. I was like, you know what? I have to do it for Japanese later on. I gotta say, well, everything about her is amazing. Do I 
have nothing wrong with her? No, I don't have nothing wrong with her. She is perfect as she is. So I'm going to put her in the A tier. That's why we start off with the smart baby. We're putting on at A tier. So the next character we got is... <laughs> Oh, I think you guys are ready for this. Makoto, aka the queen, baby. Aka the best queen. That's true, guys. She is the best queen. Okay. Okay, so if you guys don't know that in the first Persona 5, I don't like her. I'm sorry, but in the Persona 5, just Persona 5, 5, I don't like her because of one thing. Um, She um put herself into danger. Um, In my opinion, she got defended into a wee, huge mess. But in my opinion, I thought I was so, so, so mad that it happened. I was so, so, so mad at her. But the reason why she did it is because she wants to try to be helpful. She wants to try to be helpful to everyone. I was like, okay, I understand that. But you should tell us you're going to do it. Her appearance. Her appearance is a normal teenager with a normal appearance. Her appearance, she has beautiful hair. Her hair braid, yes. If you guys don't know, you look very closely in her hair. That is actually a band like a hair band to keep her I learned that I actually heard about that you need you need like a lot a lot of hair to do like a hair band but I think her eyes are beautiful her appearance is good and she is she is scary because the fist of justice baby <laughs> but no anyway her confidant is based on she wants to go, go out more she wants to see what the kids up to she wants to help a friend that is doing like terrible stuff with the boyfriend, anything, you guys already get it before. But I think that Makoto has an interesting confidant in my opinion. She is an interesting character. I think most of y'all already know that what I'm going to do. I'm going to put her... Um, sorry, sorry, guys. I'm going to put her in the ATL. I'm sorry, guys, but she is still the best. But in my opinion, I'm born in the ATL. I think, in my opinion, I think she is actually a very good character. And a very useful character if you're pulling in a party and some of our loyal. Anyway, guys, the next character we got is my girl, my girl Futaba. Now, if you guys have already seen the confidant tier list, I absolutely adore and love Futaba so much. In my opinion, she is so so cute when she does like her naughty things, her evil laugh or anything, even her appearance is like her first appearance was um without her jacket, um is like a Tetris thing. And I was like, wow, that's actually a good summer thing. And when she gets to like a jacket thing, I was like, nice choice with her headphones, her glasses, her very large orange chair, which I love. Um it's very good. And here's my question. In the code, she still wears those shorts. I was like are you cold? <laughs> but I, I be, every time I play the game, it's like, are you cold for Taba? Are you sure you don't want like wear leg pants? The only thing, the only thing we, she wear leg pants is during the summer. That's the only leg pants she wears. But in my opinion, her confidant is so, so, so sad, so, so, so precious, so, so, so cute and because she wants to do a promise list that she did with her mom if you guys don't know that her mom died and I felt, felt so bad for her doing the story I was like you know what the first time I played Persona 5 I think Futaba the first time I played Persona 4 Royal I think Futaba because I love Futaba Futaba is so 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 cute and I think y'all you guys know what I'm gonna do I'm bro in the S tier that's right don't at me bro Futaba is my girl and the next character we got is Oh, oh, um, you, um, y'all guys know already? Okay, y'all guys know that what I'm gonna do? Doobie dooby doo ba dooby dooby doo ba be right back! You guys already know that Haru is my opinion to truly the best girl in Persona 5. If you guys don't know why, because one, she's cute, two, the way she dresses cute, and three, the last one is her sweet, cute, Laugh every time you make a bad joke or every time you make a laugh whole laugh will brighten up your day Like if you're a sad sad boy and if, you, if you're crying if you make if you made a joke to her and you hear a laugh you will smile and Her appearance she is cute. I love her fluffy fluffy hair. I love her pink sweater I love her shoes everything and the way she danced and personified dancing in Starlight 
they sing it all night. I think um she is a ballet, which is so so cute. Um her voice act though is of course so so cute. And and her winter outfit, even like the third semester outfit when she was like a palace, like a palace theme, like a French theme, I was like, oh my gosh. Like Futaba is not Futaba. Um of course Futaba and Haru are so so cute, but I love Haru even more. Like I I I, I wish that I would hang out with Haru, drink tea, hold hands, and look up to the starlight. And uh, I love Haru so much. Oh, oh okay. Um, I'm sorry, guys. I got to carry here. Yeah, but her confidant, of course, if you guys don't know the confidant, I think I put her in the B tier. Her confidant is okay. She's um, having trouble with um, one of the company because, um, uh, spoiler, if you have not played Persona 5 Warrior, Akechi killed her dad um, because she's trying to have she's trouble doing owning the company and having trouble with her fiance and all those type of stuff. But her confidant, of course, I would get I gave it a B. I thought it was good, but in my opinion, it's not like, eh. But anyway, but but in the best girl one, I put her up in the queen with her team. Like, oh yes, I'm the true best girl, and that's my opinion. Don't at me, bro. Haru is truly the best girl in Persona Five and Royal Baby. Next up, we got uh, the last character for the Phantom Thieves girl is Sumire Yoshizawa, baby. If you guys don't know that a lot, I mean, a lot of people love her. There was even like a meme when Makoto and Makoto versus Sumire and Yoshizawa. Who will win? You will find out when Tell Persona 5 World comes out. Anyway, when we, I think her, our first introduction was we at a train. Um, yeah, yeah, our first introduction was we had a train, um, she gave a seat up to, like, an old lady, and, and, and a man sit there, and she was, I think, um, Sumeri has to be the nicest, kindest, sweetest girl in this game. Her voice, everything about her parents is awesome. Her, her winter, her winter outfit is pretty cute, but her summer, um, outfit is so even much cuter. You know, even the white day, even the white day outfit, which has to be a white day outfit, has to be one of my favorite outfits of all time. Of her and her persona, though, her third tier persona is one of my favorite personas in Persona 5 because her third tier persona is so, so good and so cute that I love her because of persona, her voice, her everything. Her confidant, how she lost her sister Kasumi, and how she how she pretends she is Kasumi. Everything about her is so sad. Along with Fatawa, I love Kasumi Yoshizawa. I love her. The ending got me whack. What? I love her, so I have to do it. Oh, sorry, guys. Let me just fix this. I always do this, you guys. I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm so sorry. There we go. I had to do it. I'm putting her into S. I'm sorry. That's my truth. She is everything you wanted her to be. Like, she is the cutest thing in the whole wide world. And that's all of the Phantom Thieves girl. Next, we're gonna go on with the other confidant girls. Next confidant we got is the first, um, women is Miss Kami Kami, baby. Whoa, um, yeah, I got, um, nothing to say here so this is my objection and my fact yep i have to do it miss come call me it's truly not the best girl the best women in persona 5 world because for one her everything is the way she acts is <laughs> whoa i'm so sorry guys i'm so sorry but no a whole confidant is is we get to know her like in the beginning of the game she does not like you because she treats you as trash because she makes fun of you as you cram her wake but we get but she treats you as like her student and i think this i think um like the sweetest thing is she tries to reject you but in deep down she knows she loves you so much miss kamikami is truly good her outfits though her outfits is pretty nice like her of course her standard outfit is pretty cool too but her winter cold outfit it's even cuter yeah even cuter. Her voice actor though is magnificent. She did that voice actor did a perfect role for Miss Kamikami in my opinion. Um 
Yeah, I can't just say what else I can say. Miss Kamikami is in the S tier. And next character we got is Hufumi, baby. Okay, I'm gonna be straight up with you. She was almost, she was fishing to be my first girlfriend in Persona 5. Just five. I was so close for dating her until I'm, until the Vitaba confidant, and I was like, you know what? I'm picking Vitaba. I'm sorry for me. But, um, her appearance, her Fumi's appearance, everything about her is cute. Even the thing her, you know, hell, that's why I love Fumi because of that. She is a shogi player, and I think the music is running out. So let's sweet start the music, baby. I was right, the music was within to go out, but I decided, you know what, I'm gonna replay again because this music is so sweet. Get it? Because the song is sweet? I stopped. But anyway, her Fumi, her appearance, everything about it is so, so good. Her confidant, though, her confidant, in my opinion, in my opinion, is okay. It was okay, but her appearance, everything about it, her voice, her appearance, her outfits, everything about her is just beautiful. In my opinion, she's good. I love her. I, I, and she's a shogi player. If you guys love chess or you love shogi player, I think this is the perfect waifu or best girl for you. In my opinion, I think I would pull Hufumi up to A. That's my opinion. I'm sorry, guys. But I think Hufumi is good. And I think she belongs in the A tier. That's my opinion. Anyway, guys. So the next character we got is... <laughs> um, I'm sorry, guys. Um, I'm sorry. But that's my opinion. The fortune tell lady. I am in love with her. Like, oh my gosh. She is the cutest, sweetest thing. In my opinion, her car, I, I'm so sorry, guys. Um, but I, I'm so sorry if I put her confidant in the C tier. I'm so 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 sorry. But after watching the confidant again, I was like, you know what? Her confidant is sad. Like she did treat it as a monster, everything. Like Treat as a monster. I was like, oh my gosh. I, I didn't even say that. I, th I don't think I said that. I was like, oh my gosh. I can't believe I said that. But yeah, um, I think whole confidant is good. And I think I've decided to put whole confidant, whole confidant, confidant into the B tier. So yeah, so whole confidant officially moved to the B tier. And the game of, and the game of kid is still on the C tier. But whole laugh again. The footage tail ladies laugh. It's cute. Not, not as cute as Haru. Not as cute as Haru. Remember that. But cute. In my opinion, she's the second or third best girl for me. I absolutely love her. Her appearance, everything. Um, I thought that her being a country thing is actually pretty cute. And every time she speaks in country, I was like, oh man, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't meet you. I'm so sorry. I was like, oh my god, you're so cute. Her appearance, her voice actor, everything about her is good. Um, I love how she actually predict, predicts like what's happened to the um, Joko's confidant things. And I think my favorite part of her confidant is when um, she asks Joko, "Are you, are you, are do you like older women?" And there's and, and Joko, and there's two options. It was like, "Why do you ask?" And hey, yes, I am. I was like, "What?" And of course. I have to do it and she said oh for real <laughs> but yeah I think that she is good she's funny cute and if you guys love if you guys love giving you future predicting I think that's the perfect waifu aka, aka the best girl for you in my opinion she is the second third best girl for me I don't know who's the best third best girl I, my, okay I'm sorry second best girl in my opinion don't have me but next girl that we got is okay in the beginning of the video, I know that I showed everything out, but in my opinion, I have no idea why I'm gonna put Tay Takamaki in the tier list. In my okay, let's talk about her confidant. Her confidant is good. She treats you as, as a little guinea pig, which I actually love the nickname for it. She actually used the nickname for the rest of the game. Um, but in my opinion, is she cute? Yes. Her appearance wise, her appearance wise, whoa. <laughs> Um, her parents wearing of course, her normal clothes is the doctor, her doctor standard outfit, and I uh, think like, the Kodo, the day outfit. She wears like a spider web t shirt, um, web, um, long pants. And I thought, okay, she's pretty fashionable. And her, um, 
in her like winter she was a full car I was like okay I like that but I don't know what I would put her in in my opinion I wouldn't want to give her a B in my opinion I'm going to give her an A A. I don't know what I would give her so uh, this is so hard Uh, no let's put you right here and I will say the end of the video right now you're in A or B tier so next character we got is okay okay if you guys don't know that Ohio is truly the worst girl in Song 5. But in my opinion, she's kind of cute. In my opinion, she's kind of cute. But is she the best girl? No. Is she like the best confidant? In my opinion, she is okay. Like her confidant is pretty interesting and pretty pretty dangerous too. But in my opinion, I really want to give her a D. Like for for I was like making this video, I really want to give her a D. And I really want to give her a C. But in my opinion, I'm so sorry guys. I'm so sorry. I think most of y'all will get hit me for this. Oh, I'm so sorry, you guys. B, I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm so sorry. Like, in my opinion, she is actually, in my opinion, pretty fashionable. She actually the most, in my opinion, fashionable girl. I, I her, like her camo and everything. She's new sport. I was like, okay, I like that outfit. Even her, like her orange jacket. I was like, whoa, okay, I like that. So, in my opinion. I have to give her. I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm so sorry, but I actually like her. Like I like not. In my opinion, she of course she's not the best girl, but I actually like her as how she is, like her personality, everything, how she gets drunk, which is pretty weird. Um, but no, I actually like her. She wants to stay with my side Shoko. She wants to do girlfriend and boyfriend thing. I was like, oh, that's actually that actually bump her up because she wants to try. Things with Joker, like boyfriend and girlfriend relationship thing. So, yeah, so I, in my opinion, I'll just put her in B tier. And I think this might be the last girl in the game. In my opinion, the, um, I decided to add her. Next character we got is Why? Why were you a one man's coffin? I'm like, this doesn't make sense. This is outrageous. I told you, outrageous. So I need you, man. <laughs> but no, um, I was so, so nervous that um, we might get romance in um, with Sai Mijima in Persona 5 Royal because in Persona 5, um, we did not get to get romance to Sai Nijima because a lot of people want that. And when Persona 5 Royal came out, we did not get to get a romance Sai Nijima. I was so upset because of my opinion, she's actually pretty cute. Oh, her act, actually, I like her hair, her everything about her, her dress. Actually, yes, she actually wears a dress in Persona 5 anime, um, the anime Valentine's Day. Um, but yeah, I actually like her appearance, her makeup, her lipstick, or everything about it. Even in my opinion, one of my favorite voice actor in Persona 5 world because the way she screams at you, the way she talks back at you, the way everything about her, it just mwah, like, mwah, mwah, like. Oh, I love her. Like, I'm so sorry, guys, if I'm being, like, a simp right now. Because right now, I'm actually a simp right now. <laughs> but, like, she is so cute. In my opinion, I have to do it. I have to put her in an A tier. I'm so sorry, guys, that I have to do it, like, in an A tier. And right now, we still have to take the comic key. Nowhere else to go. Like, hmm. Where am I going to put her at? And I think it over. And Yes. I have to do it. Oh, sorry guys. Let me just oh, there we go. I have to do it. A tier. A tier. Q serious. She makes jokes sometimes. Her fashionable. Her voice actor. The new one made, made me bump it up. Like bump it up. I was listening to B tier. I was like, oh I forgot. Her voice actor did an amazing job bringing Tay to Comic Key, her own Tay to Comic Key into Persona 5 World. In my opinion, she did an amazing job with this um with actually with her um Tate's coming voice and I actually love her voice even I'm so sorry guys even the Japanese voice is good too like I can make it's actually pretty good and I and that's this is it for the tier list and there you have it guys this is my tier list of all the Persona 5 girls and Persona 5 Royal tier list and what you guys think and I know I know I'm gonna get so much hate for this <laughs> but no um I think this tier list is actually good in my opinion um I think this is all the 
girl Tealist, we got um defensive girls, we got um Fataba, um Surume, on Bakota and Haru and all the like other confidants, Miss Kami Kami Miss Kamakami, um Tabuya, aka um the Funny Tail Lady, Rufumi, Sanijima. I wish it was one minute, but I decided to add her. Um, Tay the Comic Key and Ohio. I think that's my official compliment tier list. So I think I did a pretty good job with this tier. And I'll ask you guys, what's your, I'll ask you guys your question? Who is your best girl in Persona 5? And who is your least favorite girl in Persona 5? Let me comment below what you guys think of this tier list. And if you guys do like my new intro, because I'm trying to get festive, because it's all the way December, you know what December means? Christmas! Yeah! So I hope you guys like my, um, Christmas opening intro. I decided to like, you know what? Instead of me, I'm gonna add like a cartoon character. And you know what? Garfield, like, like that's the closest Christmas thing I can find. So I hope you guys like the new Christmas intro. And I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you subscribe, like this video, like my other videos. And um, the two songs, um, if you guys want to listen to the first song is sweet, and this song right now is No More What Is. I'll leave in the songs in the description below. I don't own any music that belongs to the video. Make sure to subscribe, like this video, like my other videos. See you guys next video. Peace out. Peace out.